Here's a quick insight into how Seiko began. In 1881, a 21-year-old entrepreneur named Kentaro Hattori opened the shop selling and repairing watches and clocks in central Tokyo. 11 years later in 1892, Hattori bought a disused factory in Tokyo and founded Seikosha. Throughout the 1890s, the success of Seikosha's wall clock business increased which led Kentaro to evolve past that range of his business. So, in 1895, he created a pocket watch called the Timekeeper. The Timekeeper was then the springboard for the Laurel, the first Japanese wristwatch, which was produced in 1913 and made Kentaro a true innovator in the watch industry. And the rest, as they say, is history.